What if you have multiple response questions, but you want to pick one, but you don't want to change the free form and da 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 da? I have a solution. Hey there, my name is Nate and welcome to this video. If you need some help with your storyline project, maybe there's a bug you just cannot solve or you want an overview of how the project is built, you can go over to storylineaudit.com and I'll help you out. All right, let's jump into this video. So here's my super simple question and I have four uh, answers and let's say I just changed some other type of question here and I select that only option one can be uh, is the correct one but user can pick any option here. However, this is a multiple response type of freeform. So when you preview, you can select all of them, which is not great. You just want to pick one. But now you don't want to change and go and remove the free form and you know all that jazz. So what can you do? Simple solution, button set. You select all the items, select them, button set, button set. Now when you preview, you can only pick one, although this is the multiple response type of free form. Great, but here's a bonus tip. Now let's say you have uh, here all of the above. The classic all of the above, which is almost always correct from my experience. Now, you would want multiple uh, options. So let's just disable button set, none. And here I have I'll enable shuffle answers. So now what happens is all of the above sort of doesn't fit anymore because it should be at the bottom, but it's shuffled. So what can you do? This. Right click on all of the above and select anchor choice. Now this choice is now anchored. <laughs> Shocker there. And it's not going to move. Ta-da! You can replay and you can just see how everything changes except for the all of the above. And as a bonus, bonus, bonus tip here, in some other video about drag and drop, I stated that you cannot now shuffle these because object that's off screen could become on screen. And that's not really true because you can also anchor drag and drop items. So one item is always in the same position and other items are shuffled. So you can use this everywhere in the free form where you have many objects to pick from. There you go. Two simple tips, extra bonus one, maybe 13, who knows? Anyway, have a great day. I'll talk to you in the next video.